we're using our voice and we're coming together in love. I came to this event uh, to learn more about the Native American indigenous culture, music, dance, and to enjoy Vizcaya in the evening. I've never been here in the evening hours. I like the performance, the ritual that they did when they're saluting the south, the north, the east, the west, the sky, and below us. You know, that ritual felt very yeah. unique and uh, at the same time very universal. I'm a citizen of the Seminole Tribe of Florida and my cultural background, my heritage is Miccosukee. I think these events are very important for community, especially people in South Florida because other states have more of a tribal presence and people know that there's tribes involved on the land there. But here in South Florida, even though the Seminole and Miccosukee have a big impact on politics and land preservation, Everglades restoration, people still seem to think that Indians aren't around here. I'll tell people I'm native or that there's tribes here and people will always say like, oh really, where? And I'm like, you live in Hollywood, dude. The Hollywood reservation is down the street. And for people like me, you know, it's a good opportunity to also showcase indigenous art from Central America. My family is Choiti Maya. A lot of people don't know that the Maya still exist. We still have languages, we have cultures, communities. Not only do we still exist, we're still creating art that preserves a very ancient culture. It's really cool to connect with the local artists that are here the people making jewelry, I have some beautiful beadwork. I got an awesome necklace from one of the artists that are here and some really dope skateboard designs by another artist, Wilson, I think is his name. I think it exposes us to parts of our community that we don't get to interact or intersect with often. And just to experience this beautiful night at Vizcaya celebrating all of our indigenous communities here in South Florida. So it's beautiful to me to see the resilience of indigenous people and the fact that we, against all odds, are still here, still practicing our cultures and still taking up space. Yeah.